But he went still, in to do a tank wash. Said it wasn't draining good at the back. So there's still some in there, right? There could be trace amounts. Okay. Tonight's big story, there are new revelations emerging surrounding a deadly disaster involving hazardous materials that unfolded last summer. As we get a new look at the chaotic aftermath, the incident claiming the lives of two car wash employees after they entered a trailer tank. Team 12's Adriana Loya has the newly released body camera video and then the chain of events that follow. August 29, shortly before 1 p.m. They're inside the tank here. Avondale police respond to a hazmat situation at Danny's truck wash. The initial report, two employees unconscious inside a trailer tank. An officer taking a peek inside the tank. No, he's not. But only able to see one of them. He's just laying there. Fire and medics arriving at the scene. You guys know who the manager would be? They said, from what we've asked, the manager is one of the guys inside that tank. The two employees identified as Jose Perez and Roberto Longoria. How long have they been there? I don't know. As first responders figure out how to get them out of the tank. Came back out, he says, it's draining slow. The trailer's driver telling police Jose entered the tank first after a drainage issue. I said, hey, is your partner all right? That's when Roberto walked up next to him. Called him, he didn't answer. Called him a second time, he didn't answer. Then he went up top and started to go in the manhole. The driver tells police that Roberto saw Jose unconscious. So Roberto grabbed a respirator mask, called 911, and handed the phone to the driver, who doesn't know if Roberto put on the mask. We don't usually go, go in those tanks. So they don't know what's in there. The car wash owner and operation manager telling police it's company protocol to wear personal protective equipment when entering a tank. But during a walkthrough, police only able to find suits and boot slip covers. Yeah. They have to do their yearly inspection, so I came here to get it washed okay. out. The driver saying the trailer was due for an annual inspection. That's why the inside had to be cleaned out. Hopefully we can hurry up, get them out, and then take them to the hospital and they get the care that they need. Now, the two men never made it to the hospital. The medical examiner has ruled the cause of death as accidental, so there is no longer a criminal investigation. However, the Arizona Department of Occupational Health and Safety is still investigating. Caribe, Mark.